My name is Alicia Garcia, and I talk about uh, a project uh, developed with Francisco and Maria Jose Rodriguez Conde from the University of Salamanca. Uh, uh, we uh, develop a technological ecosystem for manage all the knowledge uh, cre created inside uh, the PSG program, Education in the Knowledge Society from the University of Salamanca. The main aim of this program is uh, uh, the teaching learning processes uh, as a driving force of the Knowledge Society. This is an interdisciplinary and multicultural uh, approach uh, of the knowledge. And uh, this program is supported by different research groups from the University of Salamanca. Uh, oh. Okay, this. Different individual, this individual researcher from the same university. And uh, national and international researcher from another universities. And, um, Spurs in different uh, research lines. The main research lines that uh, are uh, supported in this program are from the education assessment, uh, human computer interaction in learning, computer in education, robotic in education. You, you see, all of them are uh, from different from different uh, studies, but they have uh, a key factor, the education. The methodology used to develop this uh, technological ecosystem has a combination of two agile methods. First, Scrum as a methodology based on a prioristic tax, depending on the benefit that provide to the final user of the project. And uh, another agile method, uh, Kanban, that is a, an approach to intro introducing chains to existing software development life cycle of project management methodology. If you visit our, our play, working place, we have a big white uh, wall with a lot of posit and that Kanban. First, the technological ecosystem of the program is based on an architectural pattern that we are developing and other works. This uh, technological ecosystem com combines not only uh, technology, combined uh, two human elements as part of the ecosystem. Uh, there are four layers, architecture and there are two input streams that represent the, that human factor. So if you see this uh, diagram, there are the first layer, an infrastructure layer that is composed by a mail server provided by the University of Salamanca, a user management system provided uh, by the PhD program. Later, uh, we implement a uh, uh, a static data management layer supported by the Gradle's repository from the university. Uh, the most important layer is the service layer because here you have the main component to uh, managing the knowledge inside the, the program and several social tools that are, are included in the ecosystem. And finally, a presentation layer that uh, ensure the, the design and the, the interface of the all elements inside the technological ecosystem are a similar aspect. 
And finally, uh, to input a stream that are very, very important because uh, one, provide the management of the technological ecosystem by uh, the academic committee uh, of the PhD program. And the methodology input stream uh, are provided by the quality committee. So next we go to see how we work. The, the different processes of the knowledge management has been modeled through business process, uh, model annotation, BPM, and diagrams that uh, allow to describe the processes with a high uh, abstraction level and uh, provide uh, that the ecosystem support uh, different, uh, all the, the um, support all the activities related to the knowledge, uh, from the creation, generation, storable, uh, sharing. First, uh, we are center uh, our diagrams in the dissemination and creation inside the uh, technological ecosystem because uh, it's very important that processes in a PSG program. Uh, there are um, two ways to disseminate and serving the, the knowledge. First, from the PSD to the students of the program and from the uh, students to the program. The students to the program uh, are provided by several tools to share their evidence with their tutors, their teachers, and with the all research community in the world. Because the technological ecosystem provides provide, uh, a process to create that evidence, uh, configure uh, several privacy options, and uh, share through the platform. Moreover, the other uh, way to disseminate the knowledge from the PhD to the students are through the process to publish information through the technological ecosystem. So any user, so any student, any teacher, and any person uh, registered on the platform can share uh, relevant information about research through the technological ecosystem. And two ways, provide several notifications and publish on Twitter or in the repository of the technological ecosystem, Gredos, here. The other main uh, process inside the technological ecosystem support the evolution of them. So the quality committee of the program develop a quality plan, and inside this quality plan there are an important element there, report, uh, the internal assessment report. This report provides uh, an input to the next year to improve the experience of the early stage researchers and the teachers and tutors and collaborators. This process uh, represents uh, how uh, is developed this report. There are two elements, two important elements. One, several indicators getting from the a technological ecosystem that are um, get from the different activities done by the early stage researchers and a set of uh, anonymous questionnaires that students as teachers uh, are fulfilled. Okay? So through this process we get uh, a report to improve the technological ecosystem from the technological point of view and from the human point of view. So finally, uh, the successful knowledge management is one of the main challenges if it wants to be part of the knowledge society. So the PhD program has the, the same knowledge management goals 
and problems that any kind of organization. The quality plan uh, provides a, a, a key factor inside the technological ecosystem to provide a mechanism to evolve the ecosystem. And the most important conclusion is that this uh, know-how acquired during the last two years now is reused uh, on other PSD programs. So during the next year, we implement technological ecosystem inside PSD program in other universities that collaborate with us. So thank you very much. <laughs>